Are we seeing can we record it today? So we can. So it's been the last eventful day. The final recording twenty twenty four with me, your host, the Bonanza EC the Bonanza. And I guess to round it off, not thinking of the fat old men that were given an account of 2008 and how great it was and how it was brilliant and this celebrity and it was marvellous for the arts and the OPW and that depressed me. I think it was 2009. 2009, yeah, 2000, yeah, that, that, yeah, that was shit, that was shit, that was crap, listening to that, so, it was bollocks, they were talking shite, they were, you know, from the studios of Radio 1, they were talking pure shite, those fucking shy talks. That's all they are. That's all they are. Spiritually, I have been. Yeah, I've been doing quite good there. Not too bad. Uh, connecting. Sitting in silence. Stoic. God be with thee and all that. Yeah, absolutely. My own way. Um, a lot of relevant, relevant, relevant revelations that have come to the fore. A lot of things and subjects that have came to the surface. A lot of strangeness and realizations that I've discovered and found out about. And a lot of um, general new lessons learnt. And especially this Christmas, uh, old lessons, well, stuff uncovered about traumas and uh, all that. That, that uh, it just really shocked me and blew my mind to the core and um, a lot of tragedies and uh, meaningful experiences that happened and kept happening and dates lining up and all that and um, well that the thing has that has kind of slow down a bit there's probably a pile up in the, in the thing in the in the tube and it's probably gonna slowly drip out again that's uh the way these things work around october to november was a, a kind of finished the job finished up there uh just been busy indoors and outdoors and all the rest and so a lot of uh, revelations this year and uh, good stuff some bad stuff a mixture of everything really like a, it's a mixture year uh, licorice all sorts mixed experiences experiences I didn't want to go near um Realising uh, a lot of things are, well, more so. I don't like being told certain things, it's cult-like. And is everything cult-like? Is it all cult-like? Uh, I've seen people that I thought were okay that turned into evil, toxic, uh, disgusting, um, 
basically what their, their conscious mind was saying, what they were speaking to me, they ended up doing. Uh, they ended up doing, like, it's like, yeah, it's like, uh, a lot of these left, left wing, uh, crazy, I mean, the, the uh, um, uh, you know, oh, white privilege, and they're the ones that they're going around calling everyone white privilege, and they're the ones that uh have no problem with their having a big apartment and having lots of money and all that stuff, but yet they're gaslighting everyone else. Uh, yeah, that's basically uh. That's what I've seen a lot this year. Uh, reverse brain patterns to certain people. Uh, and all that. Uh, negativity, yeah. It's, uh, it came to the fore, really. Like, you know, it's, uh, the behaviour is unbelievable. And I don't want to go on any more about it. But um, unbelievable behaviours of people good behaviors and bad behaviors and uh yeah um i guess i've seen many 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 uh, yeah m many people and had many experiences and been out in the elements and i've been walking today which was great brandon hill and I thought, you know, we were just going to be walking up paths, but we actually went up the hill. And they said it wasn't going to be too bad. But it felt bad. It felt hardcore today. Pilgrimage. Oh, I thought I'd. And the baptism of fire up on the top of it, which is not a bad thing. Uh, the rains, the winds coming in. The, oh, God, we got it. We got it in. Uh, we got it in spades uh, so we did and so we did we got it in spades today um so yeah that's my uh review of uh this year and meeting friends earlier there for for food the usual place and my, my friends that are up from the country and they have two children and go to the usual Chinese takeaway and yeah the food is substandard but it's, it's okay and the usual thing there and uh, so that's my year well yeah I suppose a lot has happened yeah a lot has come to the fore and a lot has come to the centre and I've seen people psychically and mentally break down and Try to tell me silly stuff like and fucking you know justifications for I won't even go into it like you know it's like it's something that could it's like plain to see and they have a justification for it you know I'm not talking about it's just one one thing in general like uh one thing in general. Uh, it's it, it's like um, I'd compare it to. Uh, I don't know what I'd compare it to. Um, I suppose stuff that's just you know obvious, and people have justifications for for the obvious. You know, oh, it was this. You know, they, 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 they rationalise and, I don't know, yeah, it's, um, it's just, yeah, the religious, religious kind of like, zealots and, oh God, one guy, yeah, I knew from the, from, he went to this, like, and I knew, like, he came over to me uh, last year, the year before, and 
I could see that his partner, he was just there. He was just like a spare tire. They didn't want to listen to him anyway, like, you know. But it, it is, you know, you can have too much of that as well. You need to... I could see from her body language, she had two friends there. She wasn't... She didn't want him around anyway, like, and you start telling me about this this logo on it, his um his shirt or something he says this it's this this thing is evil like but it's keep me warm you know <laughs> okay god you know they, they they think everything is evil like it's all evil obsession they can take it too far a lot a lot of religious people oh everything's evil like they can be like it's like Obsessive compulsive ways. Everything's evil. The whole world is evil. It's evil. It's evil. It's evil. It's evil. Everything's evil. There's no good anymore. Yeah, then they'll, they'll burn out psych. They'll have a mental breakdown. That's what happens. So, anyway, I'm going to uh, bid you farewell and for this uh, new year, I said I'd do a quick video. I don't know how quick it'll be, but I uh, hope you enjoy this and. Please like, share and subscribe and share this out to the world because I want people to hear my message at the end of 2023. Cheers.